Well, we talked about it in the break, wondering if that is one of those conversations that Reed Carruthers will have after the game, the old what-ifs. Should he have tried for the deuce in the first end? They know the, the curl of the ice. I think that for Reed, just wasn't confident exactly where to put the broom in a fresh path and wanted to make sure that he got his single point with his hammer. Yeah, and I think, and I said to you too, it's, he had, yeah, even if he played up weight, and was forced to roll, he had, what, 10 feet? We had lots of space. Yeah. That's fine. You can... If you lose by one, that's when you may talk about it, I guess. It was in the meantime. Wait, I didn't see the ring, so, okay. I think it's off. But yeah. Just... The question. You if you like, but. I'll bring an official out. You something to talk about on TV. Yeah. yeah thank you. The question is, you're not allowed to move a stone off the center line. So then the stone belonging to Alberta is removed. Reed has the choice of removing it or leaving it. Until the sixth stone of the end is thrown, you can touch that stone on the center line, but you cannot move it off the center line. And that is, in fact, what Alberta did. So the replacement. Didn't we see yesterday, actually, you, could, you can take your own stone and bump it. You can move yours. And we actually saw somebody raise it in. It yes. You know, just to, uh, and then leave it behind cover. I don't think it was their coup. I think it's close enough. Reed's looking yeah. for a, a just, mark. Sometimes yeah. in the remember, ice. There like, you go. I see the ring there. But there you go. Like, because I thought it was, like, more on the line, though. No. You think it's like that? Close. And ultimately, yeah, the non-offending team, which is Reed, has the say. So Kevin can say, no, I don't agree. I like that. Split and center. But it doesn't mean it. But it, no. <laughs> no. Quite frankly, no. No, it doesn't. Speed's good. But you sort it out. I think that's good. 